Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with a guide for the mastery challenge at Odin's Mine Hideout, the Trial of the Raven. In this walkthrough, I'll show how you can use the Thorn of Slumber ability at the beginning, middle, and end of this trial to let you air assassinate your enemies while they sleep. For tips on the other trials, see my playlist linked on screen and in the description below, and subscribe to get my latest guides and gameplay. So I'm going to start right off with air assassinating the guard just below me, but before I do, I'm going to wait till the guard in the middle gets to his rightmost position when he's standing on that small platform over the water. And when I do the assassination, I'm going to do the assassin's carry, so I'm going to hold my right bumper, or R1, to immediately pick up the enemy, and I'm going to drop him in the bushes so the other guards don't detect the body. Now I'm going to come up to this platform and wait until the second guard returns to that spot he was just at on the small platform over the water, and I'm going to use Thorn of Slumber to put him to sleep. And then once he's asleep, I'm going to wait for the third guard to come over. And then I'm going to air assassinate him. Now I'm going to go back up onto the platform to air assassinate the guard who's asleep, because to get the gold medal in this trial, to get the gold medal in this trial, you need to air assassinate every single guard. So there's no room for error. I'm going to use a similar strategy on these three guards. I'm going to air assassinate one and hide the body, then use Thorn of Slumber on one and then air assassinate the guard who comes to investigate and then air assassinate the sleeping guard. So first I'm gonna air assassinate the guard closest to me with his back to me, but I'm gonna wait till the other guards turn their backs and start moving away from me. And again, I'm using the assassin's carry to pick up the guard immediately, bring him back to the bushes to hide. And I'm gonna wait till the guard on the left gets as far away from me as possible before I shoot him with the thorn of slumber. And in the previous room, I shot the thorn of slumber at the guard's feet. I didn't actually shoot him, but in this one, I found that I need to actually shoot the guard or else he might turn around and detect me. But if you've been doing the wolf challenges, you should have plenty of practice with your aiming. And then once he's asleep, the other guard's gonna go investigate and I can run over here and air assassinate one, and then climb back up to air assassinate the sleeping guard. And I'm looking ahead to make sure that guard isn't facing me because you can actually get detected by this guard as you're running up here. In this area, I am not gonna hide the body. I'm gonna air assassinate this guard close to me when he turns his back, but I'm gonna leave the body there because I want the other guard to come investigate and then I'll air assassinate him as well. I'm going to wait for both guards to have their backs to me and then climb up for the kill. 
And I'm not going to do the chain assassination, even though I have the opportunity. Now I'm going to wait for that second guard to detect the body. The third guard near the wall up there doesn't move. He just stands there. Kill him in a bit. So the guard has seen the body and is coming to investigate. If he doesn't come to investigate and he just stands there, you can just climb along the rope and air assassinate him where he stands. But he found the body so I can get him right below me. And this other guard, as I said, doesn't move, so you can kind of just jump on the railing and air assassinate him. And there is four guards remaining, two closer to me and two further up. And I'm waiting until the guards close to me turn their backs. And I'm going to climb along the rope onto the platform and then onto the perch. And I want to air assassinate the guard just below me, but I'm going to wait until the second guard comes back towards me and turns his back, just to make sure he doesn't turn around. And I'm going to hide the body in the bushes because I don't want him to see the body because then he'll be looking around for me and he'll be able to spot me possibly on the rope above him. Now I'm going back to get up onto the rope. You could just climb back up on the wall there, but sometimes I somehow fall down. So this is just safer to go retrace my steps. And then I'm gonna go back up to that same spot that I just air assassinated the last guard to get this second one. This guard's a little bit ahead of me, so I'll have to climb along the rope a little bit. I'm gonna wait till he comes closer to me. And then go for the kill. And then for the last two guards, I'm gonna use Thorn of Slumber for the third and final time. I'm going to shoot the guard on the right with the Thorn of Slumber when he gets furthest away from me. And immediately after shooting him, I'm going to move forward so I can air assassinate the other guard. And now I just need to air assassinate that sleeping guard to complete the trial with a gold medal and a perfect score. And of course, there are many ways that you could complete this trial, but this is the approach that was easiest for me. This is Amber. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to my channel for more tips and tricks for Assassin's Creed Valhalla.